you're kind of getting the trend that a lot of degrees you're still going to have to teach yourself data science skills on the side because it is such a new field so you'll have to teach it on the side but still it shows that you're coming from a technical place and you're fully capable of handling data science responsibilities what's up youtube fam it's data life dat a life coming back to you with another video today we're going to be talking about what degrees are the best to get into data science now there is a way to get into data science without a degree but whether or not that's the correct way depends on your situation today we're just talking about the people who wanted to get in data science by getting a degree so let's not waste any more time and get right into the video now i'm going to rank these degrees in order by most desirable to less desirable so coming in at number one should be a bit of a no-brainer but number one is data science now this one is obvious but it is a little interesting because a lot of schools do not have data science degrees yet especially for undergrad they're just starting to make their way into the graduate degree market and barely barely trickling into the undergraduate degree market so if your school does have a data science undergrad degree take full advantage of it. Not many of your competition is going to have a degree in data science for undergrad. So if you see it, go right for it. That's exactly the career you're going into. There's not going to be a better degree tailored for data science than a data science degree, obviously. And comment down below if your school does have data science undergrad degrees. I'm very, very curious. My school is a STEM school. They still don't have a data science undergraduate degree. So if yours does, take full advantage. Now, number two is a computer science degree. This is the most common degree that data scientists have because data science, of course, is an extremely, extremely technical field. So you want an extremely solid technical background. The best way to do that, computer science degree. This is gonna teach you how to code, which a lot of other degrees will not. And that is the basis, the most fundamental skill you could have as a data scientist. You're going to need to know SQL and Python and a lot of technical things that will be covered in a computer science degree. And computer science programs also usually have a good amount of math in them too. So you'll get that math background too that you'll need to understand more complex subjects like gradient descent and other machine learning algorithms. Now I'm not the type to just give you the pluses for these degrees without giving you the practical negatives. Like, I'm your boy over here, I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. You know, data science degrees, if they have them, and computer science degrees, they are gonna be very difficult to get. You know, like the coursework is gonna be very hard, very rigorous. They are known for being some of the most difficult degrees to obtain. And it's definitely worth noting because you guys might be working at the same time doing this, doing that, or it might just be something that is very, very hard for you. And there's still other ways to get into data science without these degrees, which is why I'm gonna give you even more degrees that apply for data science. The third degree is a degree in math or statistics, which is what I personally have. Yes, again, this is another degree that is pretty hard to get through, but if you do get through it, it'll really help you get into the data science field. Math degrees, as, although they're not as technical as computer science degrees and not as relevant as a data science degrees, there is a lot of math you need to understand to understand basic machine learning concepts. So this degree will help you understand those concepts and on a lot of those electives you can take for a mathematics course. So this degree will help you get that understanding that you'll need to know for those complicated machine learning algorithms and a lot of math programs the electives are related to computer science or you can learn to program you just kind of have to put that into your coursework get as many computer science or programming classes in there as you can because you're going to need to learn those technical skills on your own because a lot of times the math degree is a little bit lacking with the technical skills but it is a very good degree to have on your resume if you're trying to get into data science and the fourth degree i have is a degree in IT or information systems. Now this one's a little interesting. From number one, just nomenclature, a lot of schools name this degree something else. In my school it's called information systems. In other school it's called like computer information systems. But just kind of a, a computer tech degree that's a little bit lower than computer science. And this is actually my personal recommendation for you guys and here is why it doesn't have as much technical and programming background as a computer science or data science degree but you can supplement that on your own and it is a much 
easier degree to obtain. And since the degree coursework is a little bit lighter, it gives you room to also have a mathematics minor or a computer science minor too that will help give you those technical and mathematical skills for data science. You'll also get knowledge of a lot of other things that I didn't know anything about when I got into data science like CPUs, GPUs, and all that computer processing knowledge that is actually gonna be very helpful for data science as well. So this might actually be the optimal degree to get if you do it correctly. Like I said, you're still gonna to have to learn math, you're still gonna to have to have technical skills that you're probably gonna to have to teach a little bit on your own, especially the programming. But combined with this degree, I think it's just the optimal way to get into data science. You know, thinking back to my college career, I would have rather had a degree in IS with a minor in computer science or a minor in math than just doing a math degree with a minor in stats, which is what I did. I think it would be way easier to get through school. I probably would have done it in four years, not five, and I would have still came out to the same place. And number five, this is actually the most common degree because it's actually a bunch of different degrees. And number five is really any engineering degree or any STEM degree. So this can be like mechanical engineering, industrial engineering, bioengineering, biology, any STEM degree. And if this is a big category, this is actually where I see the most data scientists come out with. I see a lot of them, they were mechies or they studied civil engineering or they studied some engineering or some STEM degree that gave them that technical background that help them get into the data science field. Now for this one, obviously you can't just have a mechanical engineering degree, apply for a data science job and get it. Like that's not gonna happen. But what you can do is people are gonna see that you have a technical background and then you know, you're still gonna have to teach yourself like you know, the proper coding for data science, the proper math, but with most degrees you have to do that anyway. You're kind of getting the trend that a lot of degrees you're still gonna have to teach yourself data science skills on the side because it is such a new field. So you'll have to teach it on the side, but still it shows that you're coming from a technical place and you're fully capable of handling data science responsibilities. And my last disclaimer is you can get into data science with any degree. I'm just giving you the most optimal ones that'll make your life easier. You know, if you have a degree in econ, obviously you're going to have to do a lot more on the side than somebody who has a degree in computer science. You know, I'm giving you the most optimal degrees and ways to get into data science. And I wasn't joking about econ. I know data scientists who studied econ and even political science, even things that have nothing to do with anything technical and just switch their career paths. I even know people who studied education who are data scientists now, but again, I'm doing this so you can have the most optimal route, not waste any time. So if you learned something, please like and subscribe, support your boy. There's a lot more videos coming out. If you like this, please, please, please support your boy. But that's it for right now. Peace, deuces, and I will see y'all next time.